Hey guys, so here we have the original image and uh, so what we're going to do is um, make the canvas larger Okay Move that over there. So here's the uh, potential Sasquatch in question, the main uh, individual that I will be looking at, but there are also other possibilities around as well. So the first thing I'm going to do is, is rotate this image to make it the right way up, which is around there, I would say. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is uh, select and crop. So um, effectively we are zooming in, uh, but somehow in a more efficient way. I'm going to get this in as well, because this could also be another one um, in between these two trees. And, uh, you know, everyone has their own kind of opinion about these things of, or what even what this could actually be. That's fair enough. Yeah, it could possibly be a stump. Uh, you know, that is possible, but it is also possible that it could be a Sasquatch. You know, so. This is uh, something that needs to be investigated. I think it is definitely worth, um, definitely merits an investigation. So brightness and cross uh, contrast here. And let's give that another one. And drop the highlights, shadows and highlights. So fill in the the highlighted areas. Maybe bring out the shadow a bit, maybe. Yeah. And I don't know if it's if it's worth possibly making another crop of this. Yeah, sometimes when you boost the contrast, obviously, uh, as you know, as I said many times, you're going to get a lot of uh, saturation coming out. So, yeah, it could possibly be eyes here, nose, mouth, or this could be the mouth, nose. So this is something that definitely needs looking into and um, uh, if possible to get a comparison shot, a, um, a return visit and uh, to get a comparison to see if, well, to see if it's still there. That would uh, rule it out, I imagine. And okay, so let's move on to another possibility, which I noticed this Possibly another one here. Okay, what happened there? Let's get that again. Let's put that over here. Uh, sorry, I'm moving around so fast. It's just I don't want this video to be um, too long. Just the same with any of my videos, uh, oh, I always try and, you know, uh, not make them too long. So I know I can be a bit boring and uh, go on a bit, well. So, 
yeah, here we have a potential um, Sasquatch. This could possibly be the uh, cone-shaped head here and some foliage in front here, so which is covering the, the, the forehead. And looking at this now, I can see another uh, possible one within that actual one there. So this is another potential You know, and I, I and I I do try and look for um, individuals which actually look like it could be uh, Sasquatch, or at least have uh, <laughs> you know, no um, eyes, nose, mouth, etc. Look at this. I think I've cropped it, I uh, zoomed in too much there, lost. So this is what I'm looking at here. See kind of a, a left side profile there. So that's another potential one we need to possibly look into. Let's see if we can give that a bit of sharpness, maybe. Sometimes when you add sharpness, it uh, just makes it worse. But I never, I always never, I never want to um, over overdo it with the sharpness. That's just not helping there. So yeah, that's that potential one there as well. And another one to remember here. Just peeking through these two trees here let's put that down here with our sort of collage oops let's get it in the center down with the bright down with the brightness Oh, up with the brightness, yeah. So that is potential um, Sasquatch between the trees there, as you can see. Like I say, it's all potential, it's all possibilities. No, this is not, uh, in my opinion, um, evidence for Sasquatch. Maybe I'm wrong, you know. Like I say, everyone does does things uh, differently in this game, in this field. Let's have another look at the, this this one, original one. Let's make some space here. So we have this interesting outline here, so yeah, this could be a stump um, with a face, kind of a Sasquatch face, this could be an ear, um, and then we have this, this could potentially be another one, kind of hiding behind this one, you know, so these are all possibilities, uh, you know, we can't just, you know, we're talking about uh, Sasquatch here, we're not, it's something that really needs to be taken seriously and we can't just simply ignore um, potential evidence like this simply because it looks like um, a stump or a tree or something like that. We know they can blend in very well. Okay. Just having a quick look for anything else. Interesting. Uh, 
Um, possibly something here. Kind of looks like a baby. Or um, kind of an alien. <laughs> can see that in the in the center of the square and here it's also a good idea to bring down the brightness. Fill in these highlights. Maybe bring down the contrast. Uh, the problem with this kind of situation is there's so much um, foliage and it's so busy that uh, um, anything could be anything really in this kind of situation but when you have something which is a different color and separate from everything else then there's more chance of it actually being something okay uh, here ends the Enhancement. Very interesting find. Here. Thank you for watching.